welcome back to The Sauce with Kenzie Taylor. Today, our guest is the beautiful adult film star Kaylee Gunner. Hi, Kaylee. Hi. I'm excited to be here. Yeah? Are you? Yeah. I want to know. I'm ready to spill the sauce. Yeah, I want the... What's the sauce? What is the sauce with Kaylee? What's the craziest thing you've done lately? Oh, man. We're jumping into that already. We are. Here, Let's let me go. Take a little sip yeah, you got gonna... you got your oh. little vodka to take a little sippy poo. <laughs> and I wish I had a crazy story right now, but I've honestly been so boring. I've been watching Netflix. What are you watching on Netflix? Actually, HBO. I've been watching Euphoria. Have you, oh my god, the finale though, that was crazy. I was kind of like, eh. I feel like I could have ended a little better, but oh man, I cried. Tears. <laughs> Tears. I'm not going to ruin it, but. I'm not a big crier, but some some um, some movies can get me. Oh, okay. The one movie where I think I cried like a baby that I watched lately was called um, Our Best Friend or something like that. Oh, no. It's about a dog. No. Okay. It was, um, <sighs> yeah. <laughs> it was uh, two guys and one girl, and the one was like both of their best friends, and oh. then the girl ended up getting uh, cancer and ended up like dying but yeah it was like sad and it was actually a true life story oh i can't do that yeah i was like done but anyway (laughs) anyway anyway i'm just (laughs) i'm boring but besides netflix (laughs) (laughs) so um i know our audio listeners can't see but Kaylee's wearing some awesome Jordans right now, I just have to say. Should I throw them up? Um, yeah, show them to the camera right there Perfect. for just the people who can see. Yes. Can see that? Yeah, I just cramped for you. <laughs> <laughs> they look so good. I love them. Thank you. Uh, Kenzie, I was surprised, though. Kenzie's like, I thought you were going to wear a dress. Yeah, Kenzie, and heels. I'm yeah. unpredictable. You know this. I will say, though, you texted and you were like, what's the dress code? Like... <laughs> Yeah. I was like, just be comfy. Look I at me. Let my tomboy for you. Uh. <laughs> you got the daddy hair, so I gotta, I gotta bring it. Daddy's here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, Kaylee, mm-hmm. you were in the army. Yeah. Yes. Thank you for your service. Thank you. How many years were you in the army for? I was in the army for about five years. Okay. What was your? I was a human mission? resource sergeant and a machine gunner. So that's how I got my stage name, Kaylee Gunner. But honestly, I'm still serving today. Yeah. You are too. Uh-huh. We're still serving our country. Yeah. <laughs> you're welcome. I never thought of that. Yeah. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> oh, take a bow. Take uh, a bow. Yes, or yes. curtsy. <laughs> the ladies are supposed to curtsy. Exactly. Um, yeah, well, crazy. I think that that is amazing. I Thank love um, meeting women who have, you know, served our country no matter the time. Um, but you. that's really awesome. And. Obviously, you're super intelligent, um, but on top of that, well, thank you. look how sexy you are, okay? Oh, I, I pulled my <laughs> top down just for you. Oh, I love it. Okay. <laughs> for everyone that can't see also, cleavage galore here today. Oh, yeah. It's just spectacular. Bringing it. <laughs> <laughs> so, hmm. Kaylee, how was your year this year in, in the porn in industry? Adult? Yeah. Oh, man. How was your year within like the last 12 to... 14 months I would say mm, it's been a crazy ride it's pretty unpredictable like some months you're working like every day and then some months are you're like am I still in the adult industry Mm -hmm. like what's going Mm -hmm. on (laughs) but it's been like that um but with COVID like you know calming down we can like take our masks off and stuff now it's been um picking up more I feel like more people are shooting they're not as scared to come out and get back into the industry Mm -hmm. so that's been good it's just been been a wild ride yeah <laughs> I've only been in for like two years but this last year has been the most like it's been picking up for me so I think that within the last two years though like you're really killing it Thank I you. mean that means a lot for me to get like the nominations that you got within uh this past award show for avian and expos and everything is really really awesome Thank and you. yeah so it's a huge accolade to be nominated for awards in our porn industry Aww. because we're like Hey, we sucked. We fucked. So we did a real, real good. Yeah, yeah. Can we? Uh, can we get an award for this thing? Or I mean, <laughs> recognition. Come yeah, on. Yeah. Like, do you know how many you know what I've been through? Have <laughs> been in my ass. Like, come on. <laughs> I'm not there yet. I'll, I'm stepping up to the, towards that goal soon. Soon. Yes. Your no, I admire you. <laughs> I would say we were one of the first um, 
major female porn stars I've met, actually. I remember when I met you, I was, like, starstruck. I was like, oh, give me advice for a young little, <laughs> a young newbie like me. You were starstruck, and now you're like, oh, that's just Kenzie. Uh, yeah. I'm like, did you like me? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. I was just telling Kaylee uh, before we got here, but... um a lot of girls, they get intoxicated or high, and they love to, like, come up to me and be like, um, uh, do you like, uh, uh, do you like me? Is everything okay? okay. I'm uh, scared of you. Yeah, like, uh, you're, you're so intimidating. And I'm, like, just standing there like, oh. No, that's just <laughs> like, you, though, that you got to realize. Like, that's why I, I respect women like you. I get along with women like you because, like, in the military, too, I, I was with a lot of women that, you know, didn't take shit from anybody. Yeah. Said what they mean. Confident. Yeah, co exactly. So when I met you, I was like, okay, we're going to get along. I never got intimidated. <laughs> but I could see that happening. Yeah. I, I yeah. don't know why, but when people say that to me, it's kind of just like, oh, oh. What? <laughs> and you're like what? the nicest. <laughs> I'm like, all I do is joke around. No. Like I'm like joking 24 seven. Like, yeah. How and can you're I be honest. <laughs> when you're telling someone something, you can't take it personally. You just have to be like, oh, that's yeah. constructive criticism. I'm straight to the point, but exactly. also I'm like a little gentle about it. I used to not be that way, but oh. I'm yeah. scared of that. Yeah. I didn't know you were different than this. <laughs> well, before, you know, when I when I uh was intoxicated and oh, high. Yeah. I was one of those girls like, do you not like me? Oh no. Kaylee, are you, uh, you hate me. I think you hate oh, me. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> I could was, never hate Kenzie Taylor. Oh, oh. Well, I appreciate you thinking um, I'm so great and everything. And I really toot love toot. your, yes, toot tooting my your horn, horn always. Toot, toot, toot. I will toot your horn. <laughs> <laughs> I'll toot all your horns, uh, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I'm loving this necklace you're wearing, by the way. Thank I kind of want one, too. I want to yeah. match you. Oh, I should get Matching you one. Ks. We're both Ks, yeah. Cute. It's funny, because Kaylee's here today. Then in a little while, I have Kenzie. Oh, so it's like her. all yeah. the Ks today. Have you worked with her yet? Um, I have not. Oh, you're going to love her. Yeah, I have never worked with her. Um, I've talked to her quite a bit, though, at like the parties that we go to yeah. for Motley. Shout out to Motley Models. Oh, yes. Hey, Motley. Family. Yeah. Yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, Kaylee, what do you like to do in your free time? Oh, do I have that? Do I have free time? When you have free time, like, what is, <laughs> what is the perfect day to you? Like, when you're oh. not working. Okay, I'm honestly chilling. so yeah. boring, but it's fine. But um, I usually am. I do my workouts in the morning. I love workout classes. I just like people, other what people pushing me. What type? Either a Barry's boot camp or my I have some trainers and stuff that will push me like it's crazy. I'll be crying <laughs> by the end, but that's what I want, yeah, you know? Yeah. That's why I'm paying them. So. Yeah, exactly. You're I'll like, just it. yell at me, okay? Yes, just please. Come on. Bring me back to the army. Scream at me. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> I love that, but I only get like hot trainers because if they're not hot, I'm like not motivated. I'm like, I want to suck your dick and then I'll do my push ups. <laughs> have you ever fucked any of your trainers? Huh? Next question. <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave I, that one open <laughs> in the air. Okay. But so perfect day. Back to your your workouts. Oh yes, in the morning. workouts with hot men, and then or hot women, mm. and then um, <laughs> I usually <laughs> I like mm. to go to the pool. I like to go to the beach, just lay out and tan. I love to cam, so I'll usually that's literally I'm so boring. I do three things a day, but it's fine. But that's I'll cam. Really not boring. I I think that. Everyone, if you live by the beach, so go to the beach. Yeah, go to the ocean. Even if you don't want to go in it, like <sighs> just, go. just sitting there in the sand and listening to the waves is like the most therapeutic thing exactly. ever. Exactly. Sometimes I'll take my jeep and I'll drive like on PCH and I'll back it up like facing PCH and just like yeah. open the back and sit in the back and just chill That's and it's amazing. It's like therapy, honestly. Yeah. I used to surf a lot, um, and when I lived in Hawaii, that was so therapeutic like just being on a wave and yeah. being like with yourself yeah. and just nature it's amazing I haven't done any surfing here yet because the water is a little different <laughs> I was gonna say like when I lived in Hawaii as well I think we both lived on Oahu oh yeah correct? you did too yeah. duh so when I lived in Hawaii as well it was yeah. like I wanted to swim all the time the yeah, water is so warm mm -hmm. it's a whole different yeah vibe. It's, oh, it's amazing I love it there but 
also dolphins, creatures. Why you're just crazy about COVID? I have to say, yeah, get off this COVID train, and I'll move back. Yo, okay? our mask just came off yesterday, and Hawaii's yeah. still doing the thing, the mask thing. It's crazy. I know. I thought we would be the do last do one do standing. Do 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful place, but I yeah. Know. Would you ever live there again? I think, yeah, I would love to live there again. But if I were to live there again, I yeah. feel like I would choose Maui. Ooh. But also, I feel like I would not do such an addict move. And uh, when I say that, meaning like I'm a recovering drug addict. So yeah. a lot of the things that I do are like, bam, 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 like right away without thinking. I was like to my husband, I'm all stuff. I was like, hey, we're let's move to Hawaii. Okay, we're moving there. Oh, we're moving in two weeks. Like, we're going. Oh, I see. That's like, how just I am. crazy. Yeah. Let's get a new car. Let's do this. Impulsive. Like, very impulsive. Yeah. And I and I don't, I, it, part of me likes it because it's almost like gambling. Like, you it's get this rush. too. Yeah. Yeah, you get this, like, rush feeling. But uh -huh. then there's another part where it's like, God damn it. <laughs> Not again. Why did I see, I jump before I think. Yeah. And so that's why I'm important, right? But yeah. it turned out good. It just depends. You're jumping in that dick. Hey. Yeah. Man, that poop. Can you say that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Pussy. <laughs> but, yeah, so I think I would do the smart thing and go stay there for, like, two weeks or something. Yeah. And actually check it out and everything like that yeah, rather than fun. just move there. <laughs> I really want to do, like, um, get a house out there for a few weeks and do content. Like, have new people come out and do a content house. Hi. 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 I'll do it. Oh, yeah. I'll do you. All right, we're going to do this. Okay. <laughs> I'll do you. We'll do people. We'll do people together. Girls. <laughs> Come on, girls. What girl doesn't want to go to Hawaii? Let's go do content on surfboards. Yeah. Oh, That's I'm cool. so down. I have a GoPro. <laughs> I haven't hey. even used it yet, actually. Oh, really? Yeah, I need to use it. It's good for, like, squirters. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's indestructible. Indestructible. <laughs> uh, so, if you had to pick... A favorite scene, like one scene out of all your work that you've ever done thus far. Mm -hmm. What scene would that be? Fuck. Just one. God. And it's okay. You're not going to offend anyone. You're just picking up one of your favorite scenes. You can have many, but just pick one. Okay, fine. <laughs> <laughs> For the people that can't see her, she's can very, I, very, very serious. Right? She's like, okay. Should I do a, All right. a one and two or just a one? Okay, fine. Um, my favorite was definitely, oh, fuck. There's two that I love, <laughs> but I'll just give you one. It's the one where I'm at the range and I'm shooting guns mm -hmm. and then I go fuck in the woods. Who do you fuck? Um, oh, fuck. I really, I fuck so many people. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Justin. Justin? <laughs> you know. Oh, d uh, oh uh, Justin from B Bedoink? Yeah. Justin? Oh, okay, cool. Hey, Justin, hey. if you're listening. <laughs> Best scene ever. <laughs> no, but that was bomb. We did a POV scene. That's um, cool. Went to the range. I got to shoot guns. Did he take those photos? Because those are awesome photos, by the way. Oh, no. That's um Thomas Prusso Photography. He's a. I wanted to work with him since I've been in the Army. I found him. Um, he does a lot of military photo shoots, and I had a dream when I was in the military. Yeah. If I'm ever, like, an influencer or some girl, I don't know, who um, could have calendars of herself, mm -hmm. I was like, this is the man I want to shoot my calendar because I just love – no one's doing that, you know? Yeah. The military photo shoots. So I flew to Tennessee um, a couple months ago, um, right before January, last minute, and I was like, I need you to make me a calendar this year. I'm not half-assing my calendar. <laughs> So I did my dream calendar. That's He's the dope. one that you that you told me about and you like rushed to do before yeah, X3, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was just in Nashville for like five hours, like shooting in the rain. I think she pretty much did this in like a month or less because she was like, yeah, oh. I'm doing this calendar right now and I'm going to do all the money. And I was like, okay. I did it in like two, three days. I flew to San Francisco. Oh my God, that's crazy. Well, I, I live in the Bay. Did you do your makeup and hair for like all of the things? I did it for the military one because you yeah. don't really need a lot of makeup in the camo. Yeah. Um, but for the beginning, um, I did the lingerie because I wanted to make it sexy too. And I of wanted course, a lot yeah. of like nude, but um, artsy nude, like yeah. tasteful. What's so it called? I uh, for that. What is that word for the nude? It's like is nude, but you can't really see. Uh, Tease? No. <laughs> There's like some word. I don't know. Uh, Badoir. Badoir. Badoir, yeah. Maybe, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it is. I still showed enough, but not too much. And you were like, mm, I'm you're going to get it. No, nope, you're not. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> shy but, ho. You know what I love, though? The fact that 
you took photos with the gun and stuff like that and did all of that. But like, you actually know how to use the gun. Thank you. Thank (laughs) you. You know what I mean? Like you actually know like what you're holding and taking photos with. I, I think it's funny sometimes when I see girls like posing with it, posing with like guns or motorcycles. And it's like, you don't even, you know, nothing about these yeah. things, but oh, that's okay. You. Kudos to them. But that's I think why that's I really like cool. in the um, video I did. Fuck, it's called band stories. I don't know if you heard of that company. Um, um, yeah, I actually did one with Justin. We did a yeah? Halloween one. And um, I cut the pumpkin one. Yeah, I cut a hole that's in the iconic. pumpkin. Yeah, that and I had good. him like fuck a pumpkin. You're the pumpkin girl. <laughs> yeah, that's me. I always wondered who it was. I yeah. didn't know it was you. <laughs> yeah, that was me. We went to the pumpkin Those patch are good and everything. Videos. I almost said yeah. no to that scene. I'm so glad I didn't because it's my best. Like it went viral. Um, that's like cool. you said, like people were like, oh, she can actually shoot that thing. Like, did you shoot it in the video? Yeah. Oh, wow. At the range, fucking headshotting, and it was that's fun. cool. That was teaching the guys yeah too. it was just a good time that's awesome you're like okay I never you guys said ready no. to see me uh show you up let me fuck some oh. shit up these guns <laughs> these gunner guns and then they all go after you and like they're all missing the targets <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> they were good they were yeah. good but uh, how, how good of a shot are you are you oh man it's been a minute since i've shot like that yeah. was the first time since the army that i shot a gun but yeah um I feel like once you get it down, once you get back on the range or back behind a gun, yeah. you just, it's like. It's like riding a bike. Yeah, yeah. It's like a habit, you know. That's how I feel too, because I like to shoot guns too. And like, yeah. I I don't we own one personally, but I want to. I, yeah. I, I love like Especially ARs are my here. favorite to shoot. Yeah. And I'll go a while without shooting it. And then I'll pick one up again and go to their like uh-huh. range or out in the open. Yeah, like, it's so fun. Like obviously. Desert areas for people. I don't just go out in the open, like, in public. And <laughs> <laughs> She's got a gun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah. I, I don't do that. Uh, not that crazy. I'm crazy, but not, uh, that, not crazy. that crazy. We should but do yeah. that sometime. No, but I, awesome. the Army, though, I'm so grateful because I got to sh- shoot, like, machine guns on top of vehicles. But in the civilian world, that's not common. I didn't know that. So yeah. I feel like I took advantage of that. Like, I just... Yeah. I never knew that would be the only time I'd be doing it. But now that I'm out, I'm like, this is nothing How like a machine gun. How often did you do gun. it? Um, I qualified at least once a month, oh, but wow. we trained, I had to carry that thing through the field for months at a time. It was, it's really heavy. A lot of people don't know. The bullets are heavy. The gun is heavy. It's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> you're, it's you're a lot like, on your body. Um, just my like shoulder porn. hurts. Okay. Yeah. And it probably kicks back like crazy. Yeah. So you have like bruises. Like uh-huh, Exactly. <laughs> yeah. And, and now in porn, I have different problems <laughs> where I'm like, that thing kicks back like your, crazy. Your throat bleeds. Yeah. <laughs> like, we have, can we tell that story? <laughs> yes. Let's tell it. Okay. Yeah. So take us, take a sip of your drink over sip. there. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we have funny okay. story time. Let me tell it and then you can interpret it the way you'd like. <laughs> Well, I was there. I'm just going to say I was there. She was there. Thank Go God. On. So we did the scene. It was a really big movie for me. And I wanted to make everyone proud, mm-hmm. especially Kenzie, as I look up to her. So um, so we had a guy. He had a huge fucking dick, like BBC overload. I think he's like 14 inches, something crazy. Really? Some, maybe... Maybe 12, I don't know, 12 to 14 for oh sure. Oh my, I had no 100%. idea. 100%. Okay, like. well, he was huge. <laughs> and um, we were just getting into the scene. I started giving a BJ. And within the first, like, few strokes of me sucking dick, this man, like, pulls my, I don't think he intentionally meant to do it. Like, we were just <laughs> trying to keep the scene going. But he pulled my head into his cock, deep, like, deep throating. And I was like, okay, that's fine. I can do that. And then he did it again a second time. And I just wasn't prepared for this. So I didn't realize my throat was just pouring blood out of it. (laughs) So the second time when he pulled me into his cock, um, there was blood all over his dick. I was like, oh, no, I bit his dick. Like, I felt so bad. And then I get up and I'm freaking out because it's actually blood coming out of my throat. It was a good amount, too. It wasn't just like, yeah. oh, a little, a little. It was about five five minutes worth. <laughs> five minutes worth of blood. Oh, yep. Yeah. <sighs> and I run to the bathroom. And I'm like, fuck. <laughs> but I'm glad you were there. You, like, calmed me down a lot. Yeah, I was just like, hey, you got this slugger. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, it's okay. I champ. have like a tear in my eye. I'm yeah. like, yeah. I go back, continue. I'm like, come on, little Johnny, you got this. And it's funny because don't give in, up. In the scene, you're literally she plays. Um, wh- what do you play? What do you describe that? Um, okay. Uh, well, I'll, since we're gonna talk about it, I'll promo yeah. it real quick. Yeah. Uh, so 
I'm the lead actress in a series called Deranged. It's Amazing. a eight part series. It's actually the first feature film that my husband Seth Gamble has ever directed, and it is phenomenal. And I'm not just saying that because he wrote it, but like it I is agree. a crazy script. I'm like unbiased. it's yeah, it's a thriller, and it's just um super crazy. But mm -hmm. basically, long story short, um my character Charlie, I is a sociopath and serial killer like just crazy 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 yeah. and there's so many different emotions throughout all the episodes but the one that we're particularly in together um i was really pissed off because the guy that comes in that's supposed to be your husband in yeah. the scene um we're we're having this relationship behind oh, Siri, Siri's talking to me. Bitch. <laughs> Be behind, oh, like behind the uh, backstory or whatever, we're we're having this sexual relationship, and you don't know this, and yeah. and you don't even know me. We don't know each other, whatever. I didn't know that you were married I to him. I think you're just my therapist. Uh -huh. Yeah. So then he walks in, and there's this crazy tension. I mean, it is just like crazy the 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 tension i can't wait for you to see the scene I'm it's excited. amazing I'm the, the eye contact and the the emotion alone you're just like oh shit what's gonna happen yeah and the whole time though you're you're guessing what's gonna happen mm -hmm. because it's not known until the end when i'm like can i can i speak with uh, trevor and you walk out yeah yeah so no one gets it at that time until i'm like the end you didn't tell me you had a wife Exactly. Yeah, when I go but crazy. But during the sex, you're very, um, you're kind of, what are you doing? I'm what like extremely say? dominant and I'm using, I'm basic, it basically, it sounds. Basically fucking him through me. Yeah, this sounds so fucked up, but I'm, it's almost like you're a prop yeah. to me, to my character. Yeah. You're a prop to Charlie and she's going to use you however she likes. Yeah. So she's telling you like, hey, you know, do this, do this. And the whole time you're not realizing it, but she's looking at your husband and like, yo, you don't know if he, she wants to kill him because she's a serial killer yep. or if she likes him or what, you don't know what's going on. You're so confused because there's this like intense eye contact. I feel like we're back there. Again. Dialogue. Yeah, <laughs> yes. it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, daddy. But yeah, I, I'm, uh, I'm excited. The, uh, the next four episodes will be released in April. So next yeah, month. It's going to be a dope scene, but just know the backstory and appreciate my scene. Yes. What yes. my throat would have been through. Yes. Throat goat. Yeah, I'm a throat go now. I don't know. No, not yet. I, okay. Not yet. <laughs> Tiana, <laughs> Tiana Trump. <are> you still. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. I'll let you know. But it's soon. It's coming soon. It's though. coming. <laughs> but yeah, so she went through a lot during that. But you know, you. So did you? You killed One of it. the scenes you had to literally pull out your emotions oh. and ball your eyes out. So yeah, that entire movie. Um, like I said, I'm the lead, so like yeah. I had many different scenes that I had to be in, and there were scenes wherein I was, um, you know, angry but showing no emotion in my face or anything like that. There were scenes where I was manipulative. It's very sexual yeah. and just like I'm gonna get whatever the fuck I want right now, and I did. You know what I mean? Put that. your all into it. For yeah, sure. and then like how I just described how I was in the scene with you, and then there's another scene where um, me and the the other lead, uh, Lissette is the character's name. Okay. We're, uh, we're going out arguing and stuff like that. Yeah. And then near the end, after she, like, beats me up. <laughs> uh, yeah, I had at the very end of the movie. That's it, why. Oh. It's, I had a mental breakdown to create this movie. I did. Um, yeah. <laughs> thank Sorry. You. Your mental I breakdown did, is amazing. No, <laughs> I appreciate that. I did method acting. So yeah. for everyone who doesn't know what method acting is, is it's basically living as your character like you're actually pulling through different things from your life and t to bring everything to the character so I felt like method acting was my best bet for that character okay. specifically yeah. you know what I mean so the best I had to go that. I had to go to some pretty dark places up here in my head but yeah the, the last scene though I'm like Avian. Best Hello. actress, please. It Thank shows. you. <laughs> Listen, Kenzie Taylor does not fuck around. Okay, but yeah, it's gonna be good. Like, yeah, that movie's amazing. Yeah, but um, yeah, amazing job. Prop yeah, applaud. Thank Little you. 
Thank you. It's like a little golf club. <laughs> a little applaud. A little applaud. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here today. Me too. This is fun. Are you, how long are you in LA for? Um, I'm She's here a traveling tomorrow. girl. I'm just a so everyone traveler. Knows. She's all I around. I wish it was Mexico or like <laughs> Europe. Yeah. But I'm usually in Vegas and LA every week. Yeah. I'm not a fan of Vegas. Do you like Vegas? Not at all. I've had friends. I noticed Ugh. the people who try to move me to Vegas are the people that live there and they're just bored. Yeah. And they they're just like more we friends. Just, yeah. <laughs> we just need more people. Just come here. I have no one, okay? I'm like, y'all just are yeah. selfish. You just yeah. want me to come to keep you company. It's yeah. funny, though, because anyone that I know that wants like me or other people to move there, I'm yeah. like, well, what's here? Well, uh, we've got like nightclubs and like gambling, and I'm like, okay, and desert. Yeah, I'm like, we have That's that in LA. Yeah, like, I mean, you to gamble, you got to drive a little bit outside of LA, but still, LA is there's expensive. Tons of clubs. LA is expensive, but look what you're paying for. Right? It's overpopulated like, for sure. Oh, definitely. And the uh, the homeless, but Ooh, besides it's getting all out of control. That, yeah, yeah. It is. <sighs> you still get beautiful views. Yeah, the weather definitely. Just things you want. The weather get in is Vegas. amazing. Yeah. It's, uh, 90% of the time, the weather's perfect. Exactly. And then the other, like, 10%, you're, like, like today when freezing. it was winter. Yeah. Winter we got a winter March. advisory <laughs> in my Jeep. It came up. It was, like, winter advisory alert. And I'm, like, what? It's winter? Not even, honestly, like, to people who are in Alaska or, like, actual cold states or, like, yeah. you pussies. Like, well, that's it's <laughs> funny. So, I'm from the Midwest. So, oh, I, oh. you know, I have the, the car you here. Have, yeah, the call. To be, to, to be able to be, like, you know what? It's cold well, what here. would you say? Like, yeah. uh, today was pretty cold. I don't know what, it, what the well, degree it's, was. It's funny because, like, it'll be, like, maybe 45 50 here and i'll be yeah. like oh my i'll be on the phone with my mom and i'll yeah. be like oh my god mom it's so cold here and she's like what is it and i'm like 45 she's like it's negative 10 here shut the fuck up <laughs> <laughs> your mom yeah. is a goat. my mom is literally so amazing yeah. i uh, she'll probably be like listening in on these so your parents and know what you if do if you hear this mom this i point. love you yeah I'm curious. yeah okay i told my parents literally right away like that's what probably the smart thing i was doing and yeah. and they told me, as long as you're happy, healthy, and safe, yep. that's all we care about. Yep. And my mom is, like, my biggest supporter. Like, Good. when it comes to, like, especially my acting stuff, she likes to watch the acting, like, so I'll get, show her, like, non-sex version of things. Yeah. So works. it's pretty cool. That is cool. It's good yeah. to have people that support you. Yeah. What about you? Um, my dad knows. My mom, she's very religious, so we kind of just don't. I think she knows, but we just don't talk about it. Yeah, she's I'm like, like, how was work at the library? Uh, she's <laughs> like, I'm like, I got out the army. I'm like, mom, I'm going to be a bottle service girl. And she's like, you're going to hell. <laughs> I was like, mom. Oh my bottle COVID service girls go to hell? Oh, yeah, my apparently. God. But COVID happened, so all the bars were closed. So I was like, the next best thing is porn. <laughs> you were like, <laughs> army, bottle service, check Porn, here I come. Double check. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but my dad was very proud. He, yeah. he follows Motley models on Instagram. <laughs> and that's how he found out. He's like, are you doing XXX? I was like, I didn't respond, right? Yeah, yeah. I waited a day and he's like, you know, I'm so fucking proud of you. Only because I'm doing good. I yeah. feel like if I wasn't doing well in the industry, he'd be like, you're a fucking whore. Or like, <laughs> <laughs> talk shit to me. You're like, but he's like, oh, you're up for an award? I'm so proud Aww. of you. Oh, that's sweet. Yeah, my Let's my see. mom doesn't like follow along with like the social media stuff just because oh, like okay. I just I don't know I I don't I wouldn't feel okay with that. Oh no, like, it gets a little weird. Like you my know dad will I mean? be like, "You worked with her? Like I Instagram? love her." I'm like, "Oh dad. yeah, yeah." You're like, "Okay, dad, <laughs> okay. come on, come on." But yeah, I get it. Yeah, I get yeah, it. yeah. But there will be sometimes though where like I I remember one time I worked with Tommy Gunn. And oh yeah. My mom was like, "Oh my gosh, he's so handsome." <laughs> <laughs> All I imagine is yeah. your mom watching Tommy Gun. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I'm like, oh god. Okay, okay mom, <laughs> this is cool. <laughs> uh, so, we love Tommy Gun. do you have? Yeah, he's great. Yeah, he's such a gentleman too. Like, yeah, he's really, really a true gentleman. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Tommy Gun. Tommy Gun. Um, <laughs> it's, uh, it sounds so sexy when you say it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Tommy Gun. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine uh, so everyone that's listening to the audio version? This is now the ASMR portion of the podcast. <laughs> is that what they do? Is no, that, yo, that's is like everyone TikTok. 
I mean, I look at TikTok. I want to get Listen, on it more, but the the TikTok lives they they'll pop up when you go through your feed, and every single one of the viral lives are like people putting jelly around their microphone. Oh, yeah, just doing crazy shit like ASMR stuff. But I think that pops off. Like, how does that viral. not ruin the microphone? You know, jelly. <laughs> like, you know, ew. I don't I'm just really imagining know. that. I like jelly, but like not on a All microphone. All I'm saying is it works. <laughs> and yeah, you need some jelly. I guess people like that. That I can't even the imagine the is. sound, but it's probably like like oh, weird. That you was know, good. You just did it really well. <laughs> <laughs> like you would be good at it. I like gurgled Red Bull in my mouth. <laughs> 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 like, uh. um, would you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? Mm, depends on the situation, the people. I don't know. I feel like I'm a good balance of both. Mostly an introvert because when I'm when I'm off work, right, I just go home, watch movies, go by the pool. I like to be by myself. You're and it o- looks like okay. I don't have any friends. Yeah, I, <laughs> I swear I'm social. Do you do you prefer that though? You're like I'd rather yeah. be like alone. You like you don't want. It's like, never like I don't have like a mental breakdown stuff. or anything. I just want to like decompress from all the well some of us have mental breakdowns <laughs> Kelly. god damn it i'm having one now i'm, I'm here for you i'm here for you <laughs> <laughs> it's awkward i like leave <laughs> <laughs> you're like my oh like we said earlier play on play on <laughs> no but i'm an extrovert when i'm with the right people like if i'm with you or somebody i'm like all out i'm like social yeah but then after as soon as we leave each other i'm like all right that's enough socializing for like <laughs> a week i'm like bye <laughs> you go back into your like turtle shell I, you're like exactly. okay it's a very I'll, nice turtle i'll shell. come back it's out very later cozy. yeah well if you couldn't tell i'm an extrovert so oh yeah actually i could <laughs> I could i could very tall yeah I, I was just fucking around it's clear that i'm one <laughs> i'm ridiculous I, I i do have moments though where i'm like okay I, I want to be alone for a little bit, and I just want to, like, yeah. nap. I love naps, dude. I know. But I feel like when I see you on at least social media, you're always, like, with somebody doing something. Like, I aspire I to be like you. I love friends. Stop yeah, it. Yeah, you <laughs> You're we'll so friends. young, though. Like, when you're, s- you're spry. I'm I'm 31, and you're 25, 26, right? 25, yeah. Yeah, 25. So you probably, like, rarely get tired. I've noticed oh, lately when I'm, oh, you do? Because when I'm traveling, I'm like, oh, my God, I'm so jet lagged. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, that's me And it's like day. a two-hour time difference. <laughs> like, chill the fuck out. No, <laughs> I've always, since COVID happened, I'm like, dude, I fucking have COVID. I know it. And I'm, no, it's just me. I'm just <laughs> low energy. I'm like, what the fuck? Did you get the vaccine? Yeah, I yeah. did the two. I'm not doing the, I didn't do the booster no, one. No, me that's either. The point of that. Yeah, but I'm like, okay, why? Like, <laughs> <you're> so, <laughs> honestly, I was, I'm it. so lazy. I wasn't even going to do it. And then I like, oh, I heard about um, how in the industry they were like, well, if you get the vaccine, you'll have to test. <laughs> <a> <laughs> but week. we still do. I know. Yeah. Assholes. That's the only, I got it for that. And then when I was living in Hawaii, they were like, no. Like, yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> that's the only reason I did it. And then they changed it back to, oh, you have to test every. Oh, <laughs> cut that out! <laughs> you have to test every twenty four hours. I'm like, there goes what? the vodka. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Actually, yeah, a little too much. <laughs> it's okay. Well, so I, I guess I don't feel alone then in the jet lag. Okay, yeah, we're there. Yeah, we're there. We're there, we can jet lag together. Jetlaggers dot com. <laughs> Well, I don't know if you want to jet lag together. I feel like now that you said you're an introvert, you're just like, oh yeah, I probably I'm w- home. Bye. <laughs> well, I wouldn't talk to you, but yeah. we can still be <laughs> next to each other and be I jet lag. Be, I feel like it's so funny. So Kaylee and I went to Texas together for like a day one time, oh and yeah, just a little date. It was so funny because like social, 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 and then when it comes time to like sleep, I don't even think w- I th- I think or I don't know if we did say good night to one another, and it was just like. <laughs> Boom. No, we fell asleep. asleep as we were asleep. We were like, night, yeah, night. yeah. <laughs> like, but it was great. Like she didn't snore, didn't kick me. It was great because I wanted to cuddle you. Then I was like, no, too much. Oh, I love too that. Much. I love cuddling. <laughs> My husband does not like cuddling. Oh, he says that I get hot. Or like he warm? says that I get hot, and I'm like, I'm not though. I'm always cold. Oh yeah, yeah. That's why I keep like taking. I the force sweater cuddle off. people. I need it. I like. I have like five pillows. Do you like so to do I the little like spoon or the big the spoon? The little spoon. What do you? Uh, you're dominant. You like the big spoon um what do you think when when i'm with a girl i like to be the big spoon when okay. i'm with a guy i like to be the little spoon that makes sense yeah but yeah okay. with a girl i'm like i'm the big spoon i'm daddy 
daddy is the big spoon. Okay. 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 <laughs> Do you understand me? I understand. <laughs> uh, you sound so scared. I want to see you in a cuckold scene. Oh my god, it's hilarious. You're it's so, so funny. good at it. I can see Sean being the cuck. Sean. <laughs> he actually, we just did a scene two days ago for Sweet Center, and he played my husband, and it was like this hot, oh, wi- hot wives retreat thing yeah. or whatever. And he was like, had his phone, and he's like videotaping Alex Mack, like having sex with me. Okay. And he's supposed to be like, Oh yeah, that looks so good. Ooh, like he I, I'm not humiliating him. Oh. Okay. But I really do want to humiliate him. I know he's so funny. He's Shout one of my out. really good friends. Oh, Sean oh. Elf. Shout out. He's, he's a good looking guy. I'm like, when I'm on Jackie's sets, I'm like, yeah. wait, when is he the talent? Like <laughs> He actually <laughs> he's, I'll, he's I'll cute. Oh yeah, he's doing he's doing some stuff. Yeah. Where he's the talent, talent now. He's He's dabbling in everything and he's a great writer. He's so. good at it all. I'm like, what are you bad at? <laughs> doing triathlons over here i'm like what i know what? it's so awesome <laughs> yeah he does a uh, stuff for charity anyway, that was too much 26 yeah too 26 many. miles for charity i told oh him God, I, was wait. Like, I was like you're fucking crazy yeah like i would be dead after wait, but three I think he miles does it for his, like mother or, like his mom. yeah yeah yeah, yeah. it's it's pretty crazy though yeah. I, was, I was just like um yeah i would die Let's go donate to what is it called? Fuck, I'm horrible. An- uh, Angels. Ainsley's Angels, I believe Ainsley's is what it's Angels. called. Angels. You should go donate. Yes. Um, so. And donate to me, my OnlyFans, Zach Kaylee. <laughs> yeah, w- yeah, when we're <laughs> done talking, I'm going to say, hey, Kaylee. What's your social? What's your social? Oh, sorry, I jumped Not your social it. security number, your socials. And I really want <laughs> you to promote yourself. And I really think you should drink more vodka. So I keep promoting your myself. mermaid. Your mermaid <laughs> cup is full. <laughs> uh, so I got these really cool cups because I felt like the last couple episodes Stop. we just had tons of cans and like weird shit on here, and I'm like, oh yeah, this is classy, uh, right? Look at it. It's classy. <laughs> you need um the it's sauce. F- yeah. Put the sauce sticker oh, on I it. Oh, I know. What are you doing? Deja, we need a coffee cups. You heard oh. it here first. I get ten percent since I just came up with the yes, idea. Yes, you do. I get ten percent of the of the sales forever. If you need a merch girl, <laughs> I know a guy. If you need a merch guy, I know a guy. <laughs> <laughs> I actually just signed up with uh, Natasha oh. th- for Fans Utopia. Oh, uh, oh my God! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, she's killing it. If yeah. you want some good used lingerie from our scenes, guys, yes. go to fansutopia.com. Spell it out for everybody, but fans, yeah, utopia. Oh, you com. just just how it just sounds. the you, just not the y-o-u. you, just the you, just the you, just the you. Okay, now mm. I want to do so much ASMR stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you put that I in my head? I'm like, <laughs> I feel like I should. I'm like, <laughs> I I kind of feel like I have to. I feel like you'd be bomb at it. You'd be good. I don't know. Some of the noises creep me out though. Like it's when people are doing like the. Oh yeah, that it stuff. puts me to sleep. Oh, I can't. Like, oh yeah, Not it's like that a, noise. No, like I can't even sounds. deal with that. Like if I'm out to dinner with somebody, <laughs> yeah, and they're like chewing with their mouth open and like spitting and like oh. just smacking, it's like we do that every day on can, porn. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but now but it's food. Yeah, it's I okay it. when it's with you know yeah, bottle those noises, body parts. Could you imagine if someone did ASMR <laughs> porn? I'm sure I it's been that done. Be weird. I'm sure it's been done. Yeah, you're right. I mean, you literally. I could, remember you could do that. Like you could watch a porn, yeah. Just not look at the video and turn around and just listen to the audio. Oh, duh. <laughs> yeah, it's free guys on Pornhub. <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when I first. No, pay for your porn, <laughs> right? Only fans. God damn it! <laughs> Support your favorite oh, porn star. Only fans. I remember I first joined the industry and I was messaging a, a like a, good, a well-known porn star and I was like, oh my god, I have the greatest idea, <laughs> Jello porn. We fight in Jello and uh. fuck. And he, they're like, that's been done. Yeah, and I thought I was literally. So smart. You're never gonna think of something that's I never know. been done. Like everything has been done. Look at the craziest it's things. Crazy like, girls, one cup. Like but there's shit. Uh. That stuff has been done. Uh. Somebody said that was not ice that cream. I would do that. I'm like, I don't know. I'm not going to go watch and find out. Yeah, I, I, I think the it. video is like off the internet now. I don't even oh. think you can find it. God. But I remember when I seen that the <laughs> first time and I was like. You watched it. <sighs> you're strong. You're brave. I was like, okay. <laughs> 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 
poopy poopy ice cream cones. Uh, that's hot. <laughs> As Paris Hilton would say, that's hot. <laughs> that's hot. <laughs> you know what she says? I I watched uh, mm-hmm. The Simple Life recently. I rewatched it because so it's good. so funny. Yeah. And she always goes, loves it. So loves I've been it. saying that all the say time. It's so good. Loves it. Loves it. Yeah. Oh, I can't so do it funny. like you. She's good. So, Haley. Yes, you have mm. questions for me? What's something someone wouldn't know about you just by looking at you? Oh, man. Yeah. What's something interesting that, like... I don't always wear I'm dresses. Looking, <laughs> I'm looking at you, and, like, I'm wondering, what's something that I wouldn't know? I you? have 11 toes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Actually, that'd be so cool. Right. Okay, um, <laughs> I feel like it'd be uncomfortable. In, yeah, in facts. Wa- I'd be following in the like shoe. <laughs> or maybe not. I don't know. I never had them before. Okay, let me think. <laughs> What's something interesting? Wait, what was the question? Oh, <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> what is something someone wouldn't know about you okay. by just looking well at you? Well, that's easy. I think the army thing, right? Like, would you guess you that? You already shared that. Okay, so fine. People next. know. <laughs> next. Um, fuck. Come on. I know you can think of something. I mean, I have fetishes and stuff. Yeah. Maybe that's Ooh, um, what's I your like fetishes? My toes sucked. Yeah. We talked about toes, though. I like um, MILFs. That's, like, my go-to Ooh. porn. But I feel like all girls. Do all girls like lesbian porn? Or no. Prefer it? Okay. I've actually worked with a lot of girls that, are like, are completely straight, and oh. it's miserable. <laughs> I am sorry. I'm like, <laughs> for the next 45 <laughs> minutes, can you act like you like pussy? Yeah. And Aww. we're going to be in love, and then 45 well, minutes like is done, and we're done. with a guy that you're not super attracted to, right? You just have to pull it out of yeah, you. Yeah, you're, you're like... I'm an actress. I'm an actress. I'm an actress. <laughs> I'm here. But yeah, I'm really into MILF porn. Like anytime I know someone's like a MILF performer, I'm like, I just want to fuck you off the bat. Ooh, who's your favorite that. MILF? Okay, so Sylvia Sage was my first. So she's one of my Yay, favorites. Yay, Sylvia. I love her. But I want Bridget B to just take control of oh. I want her to just throw me down. Bridget, I love you so much. I love Bridget. Oh, I'm, I'm a fucking fan. obsessed with Bridget. I haven't met okay? her yet, but I'm a fan. She's amazing. Like oh, she's. Yeah. She's no joke. Like she is a boss ass bitch. Like she's awesome. Every time I see her in latex, I'm like, I'm wet. Uh. <laughs> mommy, <laughs> sorry, mommy. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She's super hot. Ooh, yeah, dude. ooh. Okay, I guess that's something. Okay, right? yeah, yeah. I eat lots of French fries. So you don't have eleven toes, but you love milfs and you love yeah, your like toes. French fries too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And you like too. French fries. Yeah. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what about you? Wait, can you share? I want to know. <laughs> Something I feel like I'm being interviewed, but I want to some, know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, something that someone wouldn't know about me by looking at me. Yeah. Um, that I am a complete, like, goofball. Like, I joke around all the time. And oh, true. I have a French bulldog. Well, two now. Yay. A little little, little puppy. Baby. But Benny and Frankie. But Benny's my baby. He's five. Um, yeah. And I do voices for my dogs. So he's French. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm sorry to anyone French that's listening, but I I'll be know. like, Oh, bonjour. Oh, mommy. Why are you feeding me this shit food? Oh, fucking pitiful Americans. <laughs> that's perfect. That's per. I would never have guessed that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you I would yeah. never have known. <laughs> I'm like really, it's weird. I'm good at like stupid impersonations. Yeah. Like I can do like Cartman from South Park. I can do just weird, different things. I can see you and Seth being home, and you're just, like, yelling random things, and Seth's just, like, doing the dishes or whatever he does. Oh, my God, I wish. <laughs> I wish he did the dishes. Oh, my God. He's just doing something, watching TV, and you're, he like, d- yelling things in different accents. Yeah, I'm I'm weird. Like, last <laughs> night, uh, what did I say? I said it in, like, a weird voice. Oh, I said something about a treat. We got okay. We came back in from walking the dogs. And Frankie's a baby, so if she goes outside, I got to give her a treat so she yeah. knows I'm trying to potty train her. It's really hard. It's very hard. It's hard. I'm like, oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> but anyway, we what? came in, and I was like, ooh. I was like, do you want a treat, Frankie girl? <laughs> I gave her a treat, and then Benny, I was like, oh, Benny, you want a treat? And then I went to Seth, and I was like, oh, does baby want a treat? <laughs> he was like, what the fuck? <laughs> it was so funny. I don't funny. know how he reacts, but I just know it's probably he, he just knows, like, how ridiculous I am. I always tell him all yeah. the time. I'm like, I can't believe you married me because, like, I'm going to terrorize you for the rest of your life. That's you know that? why. Yeah. Maybe, that, maybe he secretly likes it. He loves me. I'm such a terrorist. Yeah. Like, I'm a good terrorist, though. I just want to point that out. <laughs> 
girl. Everyone gets offended. Yeah. <laughs> you're you're like, what? I'm gonna go grab my gun. <laughs> like, like the good kind. Yeah. The good one. I didn't know there was a good terrorist, but that's me. He's, yeah. The terrorist like his bomb head. It's fine. It's fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's, that's my superpower. Yeah. If you were a superhero, what would your superpower be? Fuck, I would so I don't know, that's so real hard. I kinda wanna fly, but then again, I wanna be invisible so I could e- hear what people say about me. Uh, maybe that's sad. I feel like that'd be terrible. Yeah. Maybe I should just not know. Because you just yeah, because like gosh, people suck. People do suck. Some people suck, man, and it's like maybe I'll fly. Nice. Yeah. I wanna teleport. Oh wait, that's better than flying. Yeah. What if I get hit by a plane? Okay, yeah, okay exactly. Wait, I steal yours. <laughs> yeah. You're like, do do do. Shit. Okay, okay. Well, it was fun seeing you fly for like a day. What's scary about teleporting <laughs> is like, what if you get stuck in between somewhere? Um, that's never gonna happen. What if there's like a black hole? And no, okay. that'll never happen. Okay, in my fine. world. Okay. Yeah. And I'm teleporting with you. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, where do you want to go? London. Boop. Oh, we're there. Okay. <laughs> like, can you imagine never Teleport having to our scenes? Well, wait. At an airport again. No oh more wow. TSA. That'd be amazing. Oh, God. Yo, I have to tell you a story about TSA. Yeah. Ready? Yeah, I'm so ready. Every Did time they frisk you? Bro, wait, what is that? Frisking? Frisking. That's like where they tell you to put Touch your you? arms and hands out and they like pat your body to check oh, for like always, weapons and stuff. Always. I don't know. I, know I look like the least weapon. Those person. cans you got mm, on you, they're deadly. Guns. They're deadly. They don't okay. call me gunner for nothing. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> okay, wait. Every time I go through TSA, I have my little carry-on because I travel, like, every week, right, for work. And I always bring my toys because I like to cam. I love camming when I'm off work. And my vibrator goes off in my fucking luggage. And every time it goes through the little, I have to put it on because I'm not going to pull out my vibrator before. You know, what is it called? The security uh, thing. TSA? Sli- oh, the security, the belt? The, the scan, yeah, the belt. Yeah. It always goes off, like, right before I put it on the belt. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, you can see it vibrating and hear it. These things are strong, and they're very, very <laughs> charged. So I'm like, fuck. So I'm trying to hide it, and then I put can it on the belt. Can you take the batteries out of it? Or is it? No, it's like, oh. you charge it. Oh. Yeah. So I, I, maybe I should just keep them dead. I don't know. But anyway. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, no, I need to use that on the plane. But then I put it on the belt, and the security guards, like, look at me like, what the fuck is in her bag? And I always get checked. And they're like, oh. And they turn it off for me, bro. They turn the vibrator off, and they hold it up in the oh. air. I'm like, ugh. You want to know, I, I had something quite funny like that happen. Okay. So I was going to Vegas to shoot for browsers and I was doing an anal scene. Okay. And I had um, stainless steel butt plugs, mm. uh, like a few different sizes to like stretch and properly yeah, get ready good. for anal. If you don't know how to get ready for anal, I might make a video on how <laughs> to do so. YouTube. Yes. <laughs> Moving on. Um. So... <laughs> I'm sorry. Actually, no, people probably want to know about that. Yeah, like, no, I really will. Don't. I really will share about that. Because yeah. I remember we talked about that. And we talked about, like, the feminine hygiene yeah. stuff. Yeah. Because a lot of girls, like, get infections. I remember. It. Well, like, let's finish what we're talking about. Yes. Anyway. You. Sorry. ADD. <laughs> um, Same. So, TSA. I'm at the at the thing. And I'm, like, just chugging along. I'm, like, do, do, do. I'm starving. Because I'm about to do anal. But fuck it. La, 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 la. <laughs> Going prep. through the belt. And then I see four different guys like pointing at the thing, and I'm like, "Oh God, my bag's gonna get pulled." Fuck. And then they're like, "Whose bag is this?" So I was like, "Mine." <laughs> the cute. <laughs> Come over girl. here, please. <laughs> oh. So we, so we like went over on the other side, and I'm yeah. like standing there, and he's opening it, and he's literally going through every single little thing. They do, and they hold it up. I'm but like, Sir. when he went through it, I'm so organized, and it was like everything organized, and he's like throwing shit around, going yeah. through it, and I'm like, "Are you serious right now?" <laughs> and then he grabs my butt plug, two of them, and his fingers the they're like sticking out, the and he was like, "Excuse me, what are these?" And I was like, "Oh, those go up my ass." Did he not know, really? And he literally, I shit you not, I was like, "Oh, those go up my ass," and he went like, "Poof." Dropped them in the bag. Okay, here you go. <laughs> Close my bag. Went on my it's way. It's funny because you're just like upfront with people, and they're like, "Oh, oh." Or, or the worst was <laughs> one time when I went to the Exotica convention, and yeah. I had my banner with me. The banner that you pull up, and it has like your name okay, and your yeah. picture, and it has your social medias, whatever. 
you take it when you go to these events because you stand it wherever you are, which she probably had one. But anyway. Oh, no, no, they wouldn't allow it at the, my first convention. Oh, stupid. Yeah, anyway. anyway moving on. Yeah. <laughs> so that and then all the photos and DVDs and all that stuff, right? Yeah. So I'm going through TSA and I have to carry the banner and yeah. they're like, I put it through and they're like, Who's, whose bag is this? I'm like, mine. Oh, okay. Again, go over there, open the banner. And it's like, my picture's hot as shit. I will say like, I'm all Are you wet. allowed to be nude? Um, Nipples maybe? You can be, but I, so mine is, um, I'm like all wet and okay. I'm wearing, um, it's a wife beater that I turn into a crop top. Oh, I've seen and this I'm one of you. Soaking, yeah, and I'm soaking and you can like see my nipples through oh, it. Oh yeah. But boner I, alert. Yeah. So yeah. that's it. But they seen that. And then like one of the guys checked my other bag and it had dvds in it and he was like looking and they were like freaking out i wonder so, if they know they're like she's a porn star we're gonna check her shit yeah and they're so, like getting boners back so there. Uh, they they were all like ah, whatever and i'm like okay here and i just gave him a fucking movie because the one guy was like wouldn't let go of one of the movies okay <laughs> i was like signed it okay bye have a good day See, they knew awkward. they were like that's kenzie taylor that was awkward, <laughs> so awkward. did you how often do you get people that recognize you um Honestly, well, I chopped my hair off, so now like not at all. Aww. But um, I've been recognized a few times. Okay. Nothing like. I feel like people oh are my god! Yeah, I feel like people are shy, so they're like, oh, and they, I, they give you the look, and you're yeah. like, oh, I know you know, I know you know. I think the coolest experience I had probably was, I was at an airport uh, in Houston. Mm -hmm. No, Dallas. I was in Dallas. Okay. So I'm in Dallas at the airport and it's like morning time. So I'm already just like, oh, I'm tired, whatever. Yeah. And this guy, I'm I'm at Starbucks and he approaches me and he's like, hey, um, I don't want to like bother you or anything like that. And I, I just have to let you know. But like, uh, I'm a huge fan. I, I, I think you are who I, you know. I'd be like, huge? <laughs> <laughs> How huge? I was like what <laughs> me no that's i'm just amazing. kidding i was like oh that's awesome i was like oh Sweet, well, thank right? you and he goes uh can i just like get a hug like i Aww. it would just make my day i promise i like i'm not gonna be like weird or anything like that i'll give you a hug and i'll go away and i'm like okay cool like i give him a hug and i'm like actually Come have coffee with me. And he's like, are um, you serious? So I was so like, sweet. yeah. So we waited for coffee. I bought him a coffee, sat and talked with him for five to ten minutes, and then went and went to my gate for my oh, flight. Oh, that's really nice. That made his day. That's that a made cool world, thing, though, probably, when, yeah. when fans are like that. Yeah. Rather than f creepy as Don't shit. Don't be creepy. Like, Don't hug me and then put your face between my Or tits. follow me when I'm with my parents. That oh, shit that is. Oh, that shit happened to you? Yeah. Oh, no. It happened to me. Yeah. I, I was like, okay, this is like in Vegas. Like, this is ridiculous. Oh. Yeah. I just yes. makes me imagine what celebrities go through if we. Oh could, God! You know they're probably like loving Trauma. the fact that everyone's wearing masks because they can finally yeah, go out. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. They were they're Kanye living wearing life. ski mask. I'm like, oh, I would probably too. Yeah, it's right. It's fun. I can't even imagine. Mm -mm. How's your vodka over there? Oh man, I'm sipping. Yeah, I'm sucking this baby. <laughs> sucking her hard. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sucking this baby. <laughs> so. If you were to give advice mm -hmm. to a new girl that's joining our industry, what would what would you say to her? Oh, I love that because you gave me advice. We'll talk about that. But um, <laughs> I keep saying we'll talk about that. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get to <laughs> it. Anyway. <laughs> um, make sure you enjoy what you're doing because if you hate, if you don't like what you're doing, people are going to see it on your face and they're not going to want to be your fan. They're not going to want to follow you. Yeah, just make sure you enjoy what you do. Like, don't jump into anal if you're not ready for it or yes. anything. Like, don't fuck someone if you don't want to fuck them. Literally, like, you can, there's so much, there's so far you can go with faking or, like, acting mm -hmm. to the point where your fans will be like, oh, she doesn't even enjoy this. Like, yeah. Don't waste your time with things there's you're not comfortable with. There's only so much you can act like. Yeah, you know what I mean? exactly. Yeah, yeah, I agree. So that's it. But you gave me um, some advice when I first came in that I really took to heart. Yeah, what <laughs> advice was that? Laugh. You're, it's not even that serious, oh, okay. but to me it was. I was like, Kenzie, I think this is the first thing I asked you, and I'm kind of mad. At, I wish I could have asked you. So There's so many more important things. But I was like, Kenzie, and you're like, yeah. I was like, it's so nice <laughs> to meet you. Is that how I said it? I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're in makeup. I think you're tired. But <laughs> Probably. I was like, <laughs> if it was a morning, it was night, I'm it was not. Nighttime. Oh, and I was I like, I'm we not were, a morning person. No, my but. scene went late, and then you were next. And oh. I was like, Kenzie, 
Um, and you're like, yeah. Okay, anyway. Um, you, <laughs> you said, um, make sure, or no, I asked, I was like, what do you do if a girl's pussy stinks? Or like yeah. if a girl doesn't have good hygiene? Because mm-hmm. I've always wanted to know, like, how do I react to that situation? And you said, just, you know, I, what I say is, man, I really fucking love eating pussy. Which, like, let's it, all let me just clarify, do, that's not a lie, hunty. Yes. Not a lie. No, no, no. And you were like, just say this. Um, tell them you love eating pussy and that you just want to go wipe one more time and use like this special, like this wipe to make sure you're both very clean. Mm-hmm. But that was helpful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because <laughs> a lot of people, you know, have been working like three or four <laughs> days straight and it's like, oh. Yeah. And and I will say like, new I girls mean, from experience, like I'm actually seven years this month. So oh, wow. Yeah. Congrats. My seven years is in a couple of days. But um, seven years in the industry? Yeah. Oh, that's huge. Yeah. Wow. So, but that is something that y- I had to learn like the hard way <laughs> of being like. No, it was good advice. Um, so... And uh, I learned that from um, Katie Morgan. She's a longtime vet. She was like, I, before our scene together with a bunch of other people, we did um, multiple people in one scene. But yeah. she was like, everyone, let's go use mouthwash really quick. And she made sure everyone did mouthwash first. Like, yeah. It's just helpful like to make sure everyone's being hygienic and right? clean. The worst, though, is if you have mouthwash. Two different things. Okay. If you have mouthwash and you're like, hey, would you like some? And the person's like, no, I'm good. And their breath stinks. You're like, oh, fuck. Fuck. Yeah. Please. Then would you have said be bluntly honest? <laughs> or or you're like doing some mouthwash and you're yeah. trying to be courteous. Hey, do you want some? Why does my breath stink? I'm like, yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm like, I'm just a clean well, freak no. and you're sometimes about you to go ma- down on yeah. me. Like, I'm just. Or if they're eating during the wanna, middle of. I don't want eating. my kitty to get weird. Exactly. Like, or snacking during the middle of the scene. No. And you're like, all right. Let's or smoking go. cigarettes Ooh. and they try to like stick it in their no. fingers in. And like, <laughs> ugh. Ew. Anyway. <laughs> Ew. But yeah, we go. Up, I feel like we go <laughs> off topic yeah. so much, but it's like you're welcome. Like you want to yeah. know these things. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh my god. I I love it though. It's fun. Yeah. You know. That's the cool thing about the this podcast that I'm doing. Mm-hmm. Everyone's always like, "What's the topic?" There is. I'm like anything and everything there's yeah. no direct topic it's like, fun and if you bring yeah. on guests everyone has a different brand or genre or like yeah. a different thing about them niche or whatever so when you bring people on there's always going to be something to talk about you exactly know? and that's like especially if you keep the best um, thing. getting people fucked up like you did with me with oh <laughs> yeah oh are you getting <laughs> are you getting tipsy girl <laughs> <laughs> you're like okay good thing i didn't <laughs> drive my uber's outside <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. goodness yeah <laughs> hey you could totally hang out here as long as you want hey. <laughs> we're here uh another hour and a half i think hey. um so i guess um i would love if you would share where everyone can find you at oh, like okay. anything you want to promote or any projects coming out well, other than obviously deranged we've promoted that yeah it's so. deranged is this the end i'm so sad yeah, I mean, do you wanna uh, do you wanna talk more? <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you my socials. Yeah. Okay. So my socials are Instagram at Kaylee Gunner official, Twitter at Kaylee Gunner, and then OnlyFans at Kaylee Gunner. And don't fucking report my shit, <laughs> bitches. <laughs> bitches. Stop reporting me. <laughs> so I can keep those socials. Oh, yeah. You've had to make, like, so many things, haven't you? Yeah, I'm over it. Yeah. But here we are. <laughs> I'm over it. Uh, oh, God. I'm just going to drink my, my <laughs> vodka, tequila, whatever yeah, this is. In your little mermaid cup. Mm. Mm. But, guys, I love the sauce. I love Kenzie Taylor. And Thank I hope you. you keep watching their episodes. And, yeah. <laughs> Oh, thank you guys so much. Thanks and we will see me. you next time. And Kaylee's um, social media handles will be in this bio on the YouTube video. But she will also be on the Sauce Podcast Instagram as well. Ooh, so I'm honored. Catch her there. But thank you so much, thank Kaylee. Thank you for having me. Yes. Bye, guys. Bye. See you next time. <laughs>